Statue Hunter 75 here with the piece that started it all. This is the piece that started my addiction to statues. I was in a comic store and saw this piece on display and I was like, oh my god, that is sick. I've got to have that. <laughs> And that's what got me to start finding out about statues and led me to find out what Bowen Designs was and what Sideshow Collectibles is. This is it. This is from Bowen Designs. It's Venom versus the Amazing Spider-Man statue. I guess you could call it a diorama if you want. Um, it's just an amazing piece. This one's a low number. It's number 21 of 675. And it's actually, it's four pieces. You have Spider-Man here. And then you have the base for Spider-Man below him. Then you have the massive base for Venom. And then you have the Venom piece, which actually comes out too. It's separate. Now just look at this. Oh my god. Venom's just a beast here. What I love about Venom is it's not like you... A lot of the Venoms have the tongue wagging everywhere and all the teeth. This just has the teeth. You know, the tongue's kind of inside, but it, it's still cool. The paint was really good. They did a good job with the blend of the blues and the black for the uh, symbiote Venom costume. My only complaint about the statue, which I love the statue, it's a minor complaint. It's how, like I said, Spider-Man's eyes are like little slits. Even Venom's eyes are kind of like slits. Like I, I, I like it better the way McFarlane draws Spider-Man with the big wide eyes and Venom with the big wide white eyes. But just look at the massiveness of this. It's unbelievable. Venom looks great. And the paint on this one looks way better than the other Bowen Venom. The spider's painted great. The, the shadowing's perfect. Just an all-around great piece for a diorama, especially for an older one, too. I love this piece. Um, it was sculpted, I don't know if I said this already, it's sculpted by the Kucharik brothers and Randy Bowen. This is just, uh, I think this is my only diorama from uh, Bowen Designs, actually, with, like, more than one character in the statue, I'm pretty sure. It's just a great piece. This is great how, like, Spider-Man's, like, falling back, and Venom's about to swat him. And Venom, like I said, I just can't get over how massive Venom is. The, the base is really cool. There's a lot going on with the bricks breaking everywhere, and, you know, Spider-Man looks cool. It's almost like the Hulk versus Spider-Man, where he's, like, arcing back, like, watching out for, like, the big monster coming at him. It's a nice piece. Like I said, the Ariel Olivetti Sideshow Venom, the newest Venom, that's the best Venom out there right now. Uh, I'd have to give this Venom a close second as far as statues go. Statue on the 75 here with the Venom versus the Amazing Spider-Man Diorama Statue by Bowen Designs.